Welcome back. So we have mainly clear skies out there right now, but earlier today, some snow showers, and we had mainly cloudy skies through around early afternoon. Then we really started to clear out as we got that dry westerly flow. Here's a look outside in our regional west weather camera in Scotts Bluff with the clear skies. Temperatures pretty cool for this time of year. We reached the low to mid 40s for highs, currently at 33 degrees. Wind is northeast around 8 miles per hour. Here's a look at the temperatures from around the region. So we're still into the lower 30s. Scotts Bluff out toward Torrington, Harrisburg, Kimball, 29 at Oshkosh and Sydney, and 26 at Alliance. But up toward Gordon, only at 9 degrees. That's your air temperature. And at 23 right now at Shadron. The winds from a northerly, a little bit of an easterly component has developed in there. Wind speeds right now between 10 and 15 miles per hour. So the satellite loop shows that any of the clouds moving east of our viewing areas, we have mainly clear skies for most of us right now. And that clear skies going to help us to cool off as we go through the evening and the overnight. This low pressure system that went right over us didn't have a lot of moisture for us compared to where it is right now. Some snow into the northern plains and some rain as you make your way into the Midwest and south. Uh, this low will continue to work its way out to the east. The high is in charge. We're still on its cool side with that northerly flow, but this high will eventually move off to the east and we'll get into more warm air as we go through time with another system right behind that. That will barely affect us for the weekend. So. Skycast shows that we will have the clear to mostly clear skies. Temperatures quickly falling back into the upper teens and lower 20s this evening. Few more clouds working their way in overnight. So temperatures actually could rise into the mid, maybe some upper 20s to start off your Friday. And then we will have some peaks of sunshine by the afternoon. Uh, warm front comes through. So we have a surge of warm air with which gets valley locations into the low mid 50s. A little cooler into the northern and southern panhandle with most of us into the low to mid 40s as we go through your Friday. And then for the day on Saturday, most Mostly cloudy skies, some rain showers are possible as we go through the day. And temperatures are actually going to stay on the warm side, a lot warmer than they have been, into the upper 40s to near 50 as we go through your Saturday afternoon. Here's a look at the, uh, the forecast map. High pressure is going to crest over us, move off to the east. There's that surge of warm air. Another low pressure system moves to the north. Most of its snow will be uh, well off to our north, uh, even along the Canadian border. As we're in the warm sector with the chance of some showers as we go through your Saturday, and then clearing out more high pressure in charge for Sunday a little cooler. This high is a little cool, but after this high works its way through, we have more of a southerly wind and will warm up pretty nicely as we go through next week with a couple more chances for some showers. Here's a look at the uh, temperature outlook for the third week of March, and it looks like we're going to stay a little cool, uh, but average temperatures this time of year are going to move into the mid and then eventually the upper 50s. So being cooler than that at this point of the year does not mean we're going to be near freezing for highs. We've just been pretty cool this week. Now, we do have more chances for some moisture. Now, most of this, it looks like, will be in the form of some rain. So uh, we've got a couple of days on the map, uh, 50s and even some 60s with some showers. So it looks like the snow is going to start working its way away from us as we really get into spring. So a little breezy next couple of days, low to mid 50s, mostly cloudy skies turning mostly sunny by Saturday and mostly sunny again on Sunday, a high of 45. Then up to 53 on Monday with mainly sunny skies, 65 on Tuesday, partly cloudy skies for the daylight hours with a chance of some showers into the evening. We're going to keep a chance of showers Wednesday into Thursday, otherwise partly cloudy skies and temperatures falling from the mid 50s on Wednesday will be a little breezy into the mid 40s for the day on Thursday. Angel? Thanks, Justin. Purchasing property can be an expensive process, but experts warn cyber criminals are adding to that pressure by using